uh, mid-November and I am in Bald Eagle State Forest trying to find a campsite for tonight it's about uh, six o'clock at night getting dark so I just turned off of highway uh, 80 on my way to Pittsburgh tomorrow so we'll see what we can come up with I came through the state forest here a few years ago and if I remember correctly there's uh, tons of uh, campsites uh, many dispersed along this road here so let's see if my memory serves me correctly and see if I can come uh, <clears throat> find something tables, fire ring, there's your old Bucky there, those of you who have horses, I don't know if you can see it, this little horse corral, and then there's the road I came in on. This will suit me just fine for tonight. I'm hoping that I get a nice view of the sky. Actually, there's no clouds in the sky at all for today. For tonight, rather. So, I'm looking forward to a nice night's rest. I'll bet it'll be pretty cold. It's predicted to be down below freezing, so I'm not used to the cold, at least camping anyways getting back from my Nevada trip so we'll see what tonight brings so we'll see you in the morning well good morning guys last night was kind of brutal that was the coldest one I've had since being on my journey according to the thermometer that I have inside the Jeep it dropped down to about 25 degrees or so so I slept okay, uh, but tell you, getting out of the uh, sleeping bag was kind of torturous. So as you can see, I uh, closed up the camper already, started the uh, Jeep up. I tried to get some heat going. Got my winter coat on and hat. So I'm gonna start some coffee and uh, hit the road. We'll see you in a little bit. You know, I have to ask, what is it that's so uniquely satisfying when you see those first few bubbles when making percolator coffee? Or is it just me? I don't know. Maybe it's just the anticipation of enjoying a good, nice, strong cup of black coffee. I don't know.
Bald Eagle State Forest. I love this place. The roads are well maintained and groomed. There's plenty of established campsites with picnic tables and fire rings. And just around the corner from the campsite I showed you guys, look at this view. Just awesome. Bald Eagle State Forest. It's a hidden gem in central Pennsylvania. If you guys are ever in the area, I highly recommend you guys check it out. So that's it for this week. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.